They say hell is beneath us, but what if it's actually above us, floating in the endless darkness of space? NASA's powerful telescopes have discovered something that shocked even the most experienced scientists. A planet where fire rains from the sky and the atmosphere burns brighter than any star. The planet is called HD 189733b, and some people are calling it hell in space. Imagine a world where the clouds are made of molten glass and the winds blow at over 7,000 kilometers per hour, strong enough to tear through metal. The surface glows with deadly blue flames, and temperatures rise higher than a thousand degrees Celsius. There's no land, no sky, just burning storms that never end. When scientists captured light from this planet, they expected something ordinary, but what they saw changed everything. The planet reflects blue light, not because it's calm or cool, but because its atmosphere is filled with silicon particles that scatter light like glass dust. In reality, this is one of the most violent places ever found in the universe. Some people say it's just another extreme exoplanet, proof of how wild the universe can be. But others believe it's a terrifying reminder of something ancient, something written in holy books long before telescopes existed, a place where fire burns without being extinguished, a place that perfectly matches descriptions of eternal flames and endless heat. Scientists, of course, say it's just science. No heaven, no hell, just physics and chemistry. But how do we explain that among billions of planets, one exists that matches every image of a fiery world of punishment, coincidence, or something more? HD 189733b is 63 light years away, yet it looks and behaves like something out of another dimension. Its windstorms can shatter glass, its skies glow with eternal flame, and its light shifts every second like the breath of a living inferno. Maybe it's just another planet. Or maybe, just maybe, the universe is showing us something we were never meant to see. So what do you think? Is this just science or is there truly a hell somewhere out there in the stars?